Hey everybody and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth and when we last left off we lost didn't we with Lilith which is a shame I, we were doing so amazing on that run and I've looked through the comments today and you guys want me to use Isaac and uh, specifically Isaac Hush you guys have said which is good because uh, that means I don't have to save up for angel deals I can go all out getting devil deals and potentially wreck Hush. So I'm not even sure what we unlock for defeating Hush with Isaac. Also hoping that weird lag from yesterday has gone. I'm not sure what was up with it yesterday. It was really bizarre. It only happened at the beginning of the run as well, which is just really strange to me. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, how did I squeeze through? It doesn't make sense. Does not make sense. Oh, we found the item room straight away. And it is not Scorpio, it is, I think, uh, it's, not, it's not Capricorn, it's not Taurus, it's not Leo, it is not Vega, it is, oh it is Vega, sorry. Oh well, we've got Vega, I forget what this does. I honestly forget what Vega does. Uh, oops. Shield, apparently, shield is what Vega does. So it's similar to the Polaroid, I guess, every time we take red hat damage. That could be really, really good. There's very much opportunities for us to take advantage of that. Oh, and getting a bomb synergy early on is good. Not only for the bomb synergy, but for the five free bombs we get from that. Oh my, our face. Oh, gross. What has happened to us? So we could have re-rolled using the D6 any of the items we just got. So I could have re-rolled Vega. But you know what, I'm glad we took it because it's ripe for taking advantage of. And we could have re-rolled the bombs, which is something I would probably normally do if we find it later on in the run. But early on, getting those free bombs, five free bombs, is good for stuff like this. So we'll come and pick that up in a bit. Let's... Go down first. I want to defeat the boss before we pick up those blue hearts. Because here's the deal, uh, we won't get a double deal on this floor, so taking red hat damage doesn't matter. So I'd rather clear this floor out, including the boss, ready for the next floor, and then pick up the blue hearts. Eh, yeah, let's have a shot. Then pick up the blue hearts fresh for the next floor with no opportunity for us to lose them on this floor. Took damage there, very stupid. I tried to weave through these blocks and got stuck on one of them. But you know what? No one's fault but my own. I uh, will take this one. I haven't seen an opportunity for a secret room yet. There's a shop, which doesn't really do much for us. Hmm. Hmm, indeed. I'm not sure the secret room could be, or even if it is worth it. Is it worth looking for it if we only have five bombs? I mean, five bombs is a lot. I mean, the secret secret room could be here. You know, we could probably test the secret secret room as we blow up this rock. No. Oh well. We got another blue heart and a key. So let us... Was there a way up here we didn't check yet? I know we do have to kind of be in a rush for Hush. But... I have a feeling we didn't go this way. Am I going to regret coming this way? Possibly, possibly not. Because of that. Couple of bombs. Okay. So we are going to go into the next floor with so many soul hearts. That is really, really, really cool. Because that means we can quite freely give away so much for the devil deal. And still be in a really good position. And a sack too. Sweet. And there is a Mega Satan suicide run room. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. Do you reckon secret room's here? Yeah. Well, we can definitely do the Mega Satan thing. Uh, I don't really plan on taking ourselves to Mega Satan, but you know what? Does this work? Ah, oh, damn you. What we could do is use it a few times to get the... Uh, what's it called? Like a bunch of coins or a bunch of hearts or whatever we end up getting popped out of it. I need to be very careful of just walking into a fire now. So this is going to slow down our hush run a bit. 
but it could potentially speed us up a lot. And if we get like a whole host of coins, which is very possible to have drop, we could then pop into the shop and get something there. We feel blessed, that is a good sign. There's a chest. Coin and a bomb. I'm tempted to take a soul heart in with me just in case an angel pops out and wrecks us. But, oh, I didn't mean to pick up that. But, uh, here's the deal. If I do, it will take the soul heart before it takes the red heart. It's not like the donation machines or anything. So that's, uh, that is something awkward we need to realise. There's some money. I'm liking it. There's a chest. It's a pill, which is... Speed up, which is really good. This is already paid off. Already paid off. Shall we have a quick look in the shop before we advance any further? Who knows what's going to be in there? Got a card for five is worth taking. It's a Joker card. Right, okay. So we could get a devil deal on this very floor. Right, okay. Things are looking really interesting. Really, really interesting. But I'm scared now that the angel's going to come and it's going to wreck us because we're not very strong. I'm taking a lot of risks here. We've got the healer. Okay, that's amazing. HP up, all stats up. Really, really good for us. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I know I'm kind of messing up. Oh, it's so fast now. I know I'm kind of making a, a bit of a strange one here, but I'm coming back to get a heart every turn now. Just because I don't want that angel to pop up when we're on one single heart. Another cool thing what we could do is if we're not trying to get the Mega Satan and we're just going to screw it off completely, we could re-roll the key piece. We could absolutely re-roll the key piece. I pushed it too far, I should have gone back. We should not have done this. Where's the... Okay, you do that. You do that. He does straight and he does angles. I don't think he does a cross shape. We just shoot bullets. Right, we might be okay. We could still be okay. If things look bad, we can always just do a complete runner with the Joker card. It's not really what I would like to do, but... Better than losing the run, right? Yeah, seems to make sense. Although we are doing pretty good. We're doing pretty good, I have to say. Just dodge the bullets. Just don't take any risks. Don't take any risks. It's the other angel that I'm really, really worried about because he does a, a four times beam. He does it on the northeast, southwest, and then he also does it in an X pattern, which uh, is very difficult to predict which way he's going to do it. Uh... Okay, there's that. Let's go get some HP. Let's not worry. Right, let's forget about Mega Satan. Let's screw him off. Let's re-roll the key piece. That seems to make sense, right? Re-roll the key piece. Because we could get... I think it's guaranteed to roll into another angel item, right? Oh, we do have another battery. Let's do it. Lucky's horns. Do we want that? I don't know, but I'm going to take it. The reason I'm taking it is because we are going to do a devil deal shortly. I'll take this one just in, just in case. I don't want to lose out now. So I'm not re-rolling Lucky's Horns because we have uh, a... What do you call it coming up? A boss fight which we could re-roll the... You son of a gun. We could re-roll the boss drop item, or we could re-roll the devil deal item. I don't like his homing bullets. They seem to be far too accurate for my liking. That was terrible, terrible movement by me. Should Did not deserve to uh, survive that. I should have absolutely been hit. Right. Screw you. I'm going straight for the right one. That, that halo from the sacrifice room really has really helped us out there. All I've got to do is hope that the devil deal is an actual deal and not just like a bunch of crap, like chests containing spiders. And then we are absolutely on form for beating Hush. Right, that's you dead. Kill you. 
It's another HP up and it's a trinket. Trinket is rainbow worm. Random uh, worm effects. Uh, no, I'd rather not, to be honest. So the question is, do we take our soul hats now? I guess we do, and then really, really hope we don't fight a Krampus. We do not want to fight a Krampus. Where are the rest of our hats? And that was it, right? I'll take a Rotten Baby. Rotten Baby is a great little guy. His damage is equal to our damage. And then we can leave. Got on to the next floor, so 10 minutes on the first floor is really, really bad, you guys. 10 minutes on the first floor. We've got a lot of work cut out for us if we want to get to Hush. We really do. Okay, oh, we can't go in there, so we'll screw that off. Let's go this way. We have a battery charge ready. Look, his haunt, you know, isn't that bad. I would have liked to have re-rolled it again, but... Yeah. What did we get from the shop again? We did buy We definitely bought something, didn't we? Oh, it was the card, which was the Joker card. Cool. Right, there's another battery there. So if we, There's another battery there. So if we get a... Well, there's a shop. Let's risk this. What's the worst that could happen? We've got full health and a coin. Another sacrifice room there. Oh, it's really tempting me. And we've got the classic... Oh, come on. Oh, well, at least I got it back. Oh, come on. Red chest. Interesting. Spiders? Yep. Screw it off. Right, so there is... Oh, we have a library as well. Right, we're going to blow that up because we want two bombs. One bomb for two bombs is good. That's always a good deal. In the item room. Book of Secrets. We'll take it. We'll use it. We'll put it back. Then we're going to have a look in... Here, which would be the shop. Sack boys on sale, so we're going to buy that up. Come on. Really? You guys know how good sack boy is. Nearly bought that um, hat then, which was screwed us over. There we go. Sack boy, give me some sacks. Give me some good stuff. We get uh, some money and a card. Card is a hanging van for the ability to fly. is really good. Now we're going to go all the way back. Slowing us down even further, but we're not... Sweet! Uh, the maze thing teleported us into the library. Alright, there's a black hat for us. That's really good. The ability to jump sucks. But we're going to re-roll this. Get more books. Book of Shadows is great. Book of Belial is pretty decent. We're going to put them back. We're going to leave. We're going to go grab a battery. We're going to come back in. We're going to re-roll again. Slippy for dummies and then Anarchist Cookbook, which will pop here because we might get those pots. Looks like we're going to get one of them. Oh, both of them, but there's nothing in them worth having. We're going to go back up, get another battery. Going to come down. I'm going to reroll again. And that should be the last set of books, I believe. There's another Soul Heart. We'll also get a, a Book of Sin. It's a bomb. Uh, so we should get a Horseman on this floor, which means we're going to get cube of meat. Right, we want this because it's on sale. Then we're going to go back then we're going to re-roll and I think we've hit the last of the books. So I think now it should be two fresh items, right? Oh no, Necronomicon and the Bible of course. I forgot. Which is another ability to fly. So if we can get another charge, that would be great. Uh, we're going to bomb into here because it's a secret room. Couple of bombs, blow this guy up and some mushes. Get nothing sadly. So we need a charge. We absolutely need a charge. It's worth it. Small rock, very, very worth it. The ability to fly in this room is absolutely going to be worth it, so we'll pop it right now. Why not? So we're getting sacks everywhere, which is great. There's a chest there, which we can open using our one remaining key. There's a bumbo, gumbo, geddy, geddy, little geddy. There we go. I knew what I meant. A couple of sacks, we've got another battery right there, which is fan dabby dozy. So we're going to go back and re-roll. In this chest, we get another car, which is the hangman, the tower. Use the tower in here, why not? Who knows what's going to happen. Right, so, re-roll these. That's got to be the last of the books, right? 
Yes! Okay, so we've got Gemini, uh, uh, Pisces, sorry, which is really good, and the Forget Me Now, which is also amazing, but I don't think we can take it for this for this run, because it's going to slow us down far too much. Uh, so basically, Forget Me Now allows you to re-roll the floor, which means we can do the floor again. Hey, the secret room's down here. Eternal Heart is really good. Sweet. Oh, what? Damn you, curse of the lost maze. Delia. Uh, this way and in here is famine. So we get a cube of meat or a ball of bandages for this. Whatever. It's uh, a buddy at least. We are super, super strong now thanks to all the items we've picked up. All the rerolls we've done. And Pisces. There's ball of bandages. Not Krampus. Saves. Absolutely worth taking. Oh, we're doing amazing now. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Although we are like 15 minutes into this run. So uh, we're not going to make it to boss rush, that's for certain, but we may very well make it to hush. Well, we better do, that's what we're trying for at least. Uh, so we kind of just want to get a move on with this, don't we? No sense hanging around. So as, as soon as we get the uh, item room and the boss room, we are out. Hanged man, sure, I'll fly. Hermit is handy. Death is handy. We'll take the hermit card. We'll go in here. We'll open this. Take what it has. Then hermit card out. Into the shop. 1 plus 1 free is really good. Especially with, um... Especially... Oh, no, it wasn't 1 plus 1 free, was it? That was Bogo Bombs. Okay. It's still good with Sack... Sack Boy and Humbling Bundle are just... Crazy levels of good. Crazy good. Right. Get rid of these guys. We are annihilating our way through right now. There is the boss. We'll go straight for that. I didn't see what hit me then, but that's fine. Cool. So this is going to be another devil deal item guaranteed. Let's see what we get. Should be good. It's a ghost baby, which I don't like. In here is a Krampus, which again, I don't particularly like. But we'll deal with it. That was silly. Reroll Krampus' head. We get Judas' shadow. We will come back because I really want to reroll Ghost Baby because he's kind of, well, he's kind of poop to be honest. There is a battery in there if we need it. If we do this, we can access these. If we go this way, we just there's the item room. That's basically we're kind of done with this floor now. Oh man, that sucked. Five extra bombs, I will take them. I also want to re-roll that. Ah, that sucks. There's so much stuff I want to... Ah, come on. There's so much stuff I want to re-roll. So we're going to play it crazy. Is this a secret room? It is. Three sacks, I'll take. There's some batteries. That's just perfect. Absolutely saved me time. So we're re-rolling that because it's uh, not a passive item. We want a passive item from this. But another... Uh, bomb synergy, great. Anything that's passive, I'll take. But I'm kind of hoping for like a decent passive item. Lovers, death, lovers, empress is the best of the bunch. So we'll work our way out. We're done on this floor. Well, apart from rerolling spectral baby, that is. But we'll get down there. If we need to, we can reroll it again at the shop with a battery there. Gimpy, I will absolutely take as well. Sweet. Next law. So you see what I mean about how we're now blasting through? We're still way behind. We currently are at 16 minutes, which is... Actually, it's not too bad. It's called Boss Rush for a reason. For a reason. Did I not take damage from that explosion? I seem to recoil, but... It didn't make a, a sound like he got hit. Loads of cash is fantastico. This room is going to explode into bullets, which I hate. Another coin. We'll keep going this direction. Why not? These are going to explode into an assortment of bullets. Nope. Not having that. There's the item rune. Things are already looking good. These scythes, by the way, are penetrative, in case you haven't figured that out. Uh, this item sucks, so we'll re-roll that. We only need to do one more room, and then we can come back and re-roll. One more room with something in it, that is. There's the shop, so we can always access that shop too. 
That bomb is getting ever closer to killing me. Oh, that's a good item that I don't want to use because I lose my D6. So we'll go into the shop. We'll hunt for an item and a battery. Oh, we've got a battery. We've got a card. Card is too far, which sucks. So we'll just take the battery and we'll move on. The plug charges our item at the cost of HP. I'd rather not do that. And the blue candle is an offensive item. Ooh! Bombs heal! Absolutely, I'll take that. Oops. Still on suspects there. So cool, uh, we can heal ourselves with explosives now, so we don't have to worry about explosive enemies. And if we get low on health, we just blow ourselves up to heal us. It's really good. Not an item you see very often. Ah, uh, yeah, I can't. Sucked. I really want to go get that sack, but at the same time, we just can't risk the HP. Right, we shouldn't be getting hit anymore. We'll use this on Gerdy. Gerdy's not too difficult with piercing as well. Anytime she. I want to say she, but I'm not sure if it is a she. Anytime he or she summons something, like little minions, they're going to get wrecked because. Oh, come on. Oh, Gerdy, um, Gimpy paid out there. Growth hormones is good and next floor. As long as I'm hitting the shop, the item room and the boss, I'm good to move on to the next floor. Kess of the Maze. I want to go in it, but I can't. I want to take that, but I can't. This room sucks. Come on. Come on now. Why do that to me? Zack, I need some soul hearts, please. Strength card is... Okay, this guy should give me some kind of bombs or bomb synergy, which I'm fine with, to be honest. We already have 16 bombs, but you can never have too many bombs. It gives me some bombs and a key. And we're going to move straight out of here. I would love to go into that room, but I can't risk it because we'll take red hat damage. Oh, spider! Oh, the spider very nearly got me there. These guys should be easy thanks to piercing. Me this. These guys should be very easy thanks to piercing. Give me that as well. Hmm. It's taking us a while to get to where we need to be. We're still good. We're in Necropolis 2, Necropolis 1. So we're about one floor behind in terms of speed if we wanted boss rush. That's what I'm looking for. Don't want those explosive guys to hit me though. Oh no, I get healed by explosions, don't I? Sweet. Quad shot. Quad shot scythes and Loki's horns. That's, um... That's something pretty special, actually. That really is something pretty special. I'm going to waste a little bit of time here. I'd very much like that sack. Oh, no! Oh, bombs heal. Okay. Give me the sack. There we go. There's a battery. There's a pair for a rune, which is very good. We'll hold on to that. So now we're kind of... Ah, oh, caught me. One thing about quad shot is you do shoot a lot slower. This is worth grabbing. Absolutely worth grabbing. You know what? I can heal myself, so... Do that. Troll bomb. I don't care. <laughs> I think I care. Right, we've got so many batteries. Emperor card. Takes a switch to the boss. Empress... Pethro, Pethro, Pethro. Pethro is what we want. There's the shop. I'm stuck. What we want is some kind of shot speed increase, I guess. Giant spiders and flies doesn't really do much for us. Uh, no, there's nothing here that we want. Okay, that's fine. Take the sack. Take all this. Don't know how I avoided getting hit there, but I did. Right, we have the D6, we have the Pethro. Mask of Infamy can be tricky, but because of quad shot and because of scythes, we're doing pretty good. Shielded Tears would be really good. So this guy, you can only hurt him by shooting him in the back. But, you know, piercing shots. Wex. Blood Clot is good, I'll take it. We are going down to the next floor. So we're still definitely on form for Hush. We can still definitely make it. Did I say Stephanie make it? We can Stephanie make it. I also feeling much less of in a rush now. So I can take things a little bit easier, a little bit slower. 
Some kind of spectral tears would be really nice. Finding a Ouija board would be good. Can't go in there. Let's see any tinted rocks. Yeah, so now we're back on with a nice casual thing. A blood clot, by the way, is a damage increase. I would very much like some kind of temporary soul heart dealy. I'm getting better at firing these on an angle. I've never really been able to do them with that good before. We just took damage. So that means no more devil deal on this floor too. Okay, fine. If we're not getting a devil deal, we'll at least get a shop. Right, we've got a card on sale, which is worth taking. Chaos card. Oh, we'll take Fanny Pack. We'll blow this guy up. He's one of those. We'll take Pair for now. We can come back for... Chaos card if we need it. So chaos card, we could chaos card hush. Slightly uh, anticlimactic, but it's it's doable. And you should just get wrecked, Sunny Jim. Just don't laser me. It's another bombage. Where is the item room? I'm looking for an item room. I would very much appreciate it sooner rather than later, because. Uh, we're filling up. We're losing rooms which could be used to fill up our charge, but then again, there are batteries everywhere at this moment in time. Uh, going into the boss fight would take us to the mom fight, which is not exactly what we want because then we, we're trapped in it and we can't escape. What is this cat? High Priestess. Okay. There's the room we're looking for. Don't see any tinted rocks, so we're just going to push through. It's a fly item we don't want. We're going to re-roll it. We don't want soy milk. Absolutely not. So we'll put a few coins in. I'll take 8-inch nails. We are so powerful. We are so, so, so powerful. All right, there are a million batteries everywhere. I just can't remember where exactly. There's one on the map here, so we'll grab that, I guess. That guess is nearly walked onto those spikes like an absolute idiot. Right, so we take we get a shield every time we take red hat damage or randomly? Because I want to donate. Yeah, we're going to donate what we can really, really quickly while we're invincible. That was pretty good. We're going to do it again. No, it's randomly. It's not guaranteed. It's a random... It's random. Okay. Uh, so now we're actually going to take a small detail back to the shop. I mean to buy a hat. There are no hats. Okay. Uh, I didn't mean to buy that, but we've got it. There's got to be a HP somewhere, right? I'm sure I've seen HP somewhere. Please tell me I haven't thrown it away like an idiot. It's a room we haven't been in. It's creep on the floor and it's a champion so it could kill us in one. There's a hat. There's a sack. And I think there's also a tinted rock. Right? Yeah, okay. Feeling much better now. Especially with all that money. Right, we're going to leave. Because we are still... We're still in a rush. So I would love to play that machine a bit more, but I can't risk our HP. Also, I've gone the wrong way like a giant idiot. It's up... I'm being careful every room I go in, just in case there's spikes or fire, uh, fire in the middle of the floor that I forget about. Uh, down and then across, there's the boss. Down and across to the boss. It is the mom fight, of course. Thank you for smashing those bricks in the middle. That's just what I needed, because they were in my way. Oops. Yeah, we're, we're doing pretty good here. Right, we're going to go to the cathedral, because why not? And then let's get out of here. So we've got five minutes, give or take, to do two floors. So as long as we absolutely batter our way through the floors, and we have Kessler lost, which is really bad. Don't do this to me. Okay, okay. We'll take a look. It's an item. It is an item. We haven't got long. So I can... Unless I get some kind of teleport card. It's not happening. Right, this is a dead end, so we're just going to leave. 
I say. Come on. Damn it, I was hoping for a card. Odds of getting a card, pretty low. But if it happens, you know, it would be just amazing. Do we risk pills? Health up pill is good. Fire out energy is pretty good. Piercing shots, saving our butt here. Oh, you're a clear one. I'm not sure if they're made up. Oh, come on. No, I'm not finding a boss. I'm out. Right. Uh, this way, I guess. We haven't been this way. We have been this way, but we haven't been beyond. Right, okay. We'll go down. I'm really nervous. We need to kind of go hastily. So I'm going to skip everything I can. Come on, die. Oh, I got hit. Gimpy paid out there. Uh, down. Okay, back out. It's a dead end here. Watch out for the spikes. We'll go down then. This is what happened last time we went for Ush, wasn't it? We got lost and we couldn't figure out. There's a teleport card. Ah, you son of a gun. We're too com Ah, no, this is the wrong way! Crap! Where do we go? Where do we go? Where are we supposed to be heading? It's gotta be up then, right? From that central room. This one. That sucks! I'm in such a rush! No! Oh no, we're gonna miss the hush because I'm completely lost! We've been these ways. It doesn't go anywhere. This doesn't go anywhere, right? It's just the blur. Yeah, it's just a blur. Or peep. It's just peep. I don't see where we need to go. This sucks. This sucks. This sucks. This is dead end. Nowhere there. This way. Oh, this way. This is where we haven't been. Okay, good. Tower. And so doesn't help us, unfortunately. I want this though. I can't afford to wait. I can't afford to wait. I can't afford to wait. <laughs> We're in a rush. I can't afford to wait. Ah, oh, please just be the one direction. Oh, there's the boss. Right, okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. Right, just gonna kill these enemies. The, the fire explosive shots, that's fine because that heals us. Right, we're done. Go the bomb, just in case. That was very stupid. Very, very stupid. We need... I'm taking a lot of hits here because I'm just trying to wreck him. Ball bandages, we'll take. Shouldn't have taken it. Whatever, going down to the next floor. Uh, I'm going to risk it really badly here and use the stars card straight off. Curse of the Maze sucks. Right, that took us one room away. We don't need keys. We're going to just rush through. We'll take that though. More sacks, more sacks, more sacks, more sacks, more stuff. We've got 30 seconds to get to and kill the boss for hush. This is the incorrect way. Let me out. Let me out. Down. This way. Just, just rushing. Just rushing. Get out the way. Move. I'm desperately trying to get through. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, this way. It wasn't this way. Let me out. We've got three seconds to kill the boss. Oh, I'm so annoyed. Every time we do really good, there's the boss that we've just missed the ability to uh, defeat. We are, like, at just a few seconds too late for Hush. This is what happened last time because it gave us a... Uh, a case of the lost, or case of the maze, or whatever it was, on the floor before, and I couldn't figure out my way. If we had not gotten lost, we would have easily made that. We're at a 35 minute run, so I don't want to start over. Uh, so we could have had Mega Satan, but we turned it down. We could have had Lost, but I got lost. I'm going to take the damage, I don't care. I don't care anymore. I don't care anymore. Just give me some stuff. You might think, oh, well, you've trapped yourself. You'll take a full heart of damage trying to get out of here. But I ask you this. 
Will I take a full heart of damage? Or will I take a heart of damage? Wait. Okay. Damn it. Whatever. Um, give me stuff. Give me stuff. Give me all your stuff. Come on, keep giving me stuff. Also, I can re-roll that pill ball, can I? I forgot about that. Come on. Come on, pay out. HP up. How did I do that? That was just... Skills that pay the bills there. Yeah, we could have... Uh, we didn't take the Chaos card either, so if we were fighting Hush, we would have been in the classic... Uh, long haul Hush fight. So maybe it's best we didn't fight him. But yeah, we could have won. We c I I'm confident that with the what we've got here, we could have definitely beat Hush. You know, we've, we've so much knockback on four shots that come flying out of our face that are penetrative. We were just we were so I'm so so disillusioned by that. We were so close on the time. It's killed me. Honestly, if this run wasn't 35 minutes already, I would have. I would just start over and record a fresh one. I'm annoyed. Oh well, I can talk about that one thing I did want to talk about that I keep forgetting, and that is uh, seeds. I've mentioned this before actually, but uh, I'm not playing seeds right now. I want to do them in the future, but not right now. And the reason I'm not doing seeds is because the items that are in seeds won't be in my game unless I've unlocked them already. And I obviously haven't unlocked all the items yet, which is why I'm doing all these different... Did we ever go back and re-roll that pill bottle? I can't remember, it's too late now. Uh, yeah, unless I've unlocked all the items, we can't... We won't get those items in the seed. Didn't even see that tainted rock there. So, yeah, that's the reason I'm not doing seeds. And for... So, one person, I'm sorry I forget your name, you comment a lot, but I've forgotten your name. You keep asking me to do the basement seed. I, I'd like to do that, I would like to do that, but I absolutely want to do it after I've unlocked everything. Uh, so for those of you who don't know, the basement seed is just the game on an infinite loop. You never, you can never finish the game, it just keeps going and going and going. So what I want to do is I want to do that once I've unlocked every item. That way just I can, no, just play through, keep collecting items over and over and over until... I get everything. It should be fun. I reckon. It could be like a 16 hour long playthrough, who knows. Judging by how well I play it, it might be a 5 minute playthrough. But yeah, I'd like to do that after I get all the items. So that means not only completing Hush, Mega Satan, uh, Greed Mode and all that stuff with all the characters, it also means doing all of the challenges. Which, uh, I'll show you the challenges at the end of the episode. If you want a challenge doing, I'll take on a challenge. If it ends up being a short challenge, I guess I could do more, but I honestly don't know. I think it's time for me to heal a little bit. I said as I dropped a bomb and then instantly got a troll bomb anyway. Sweet, soul hat. And there's the boss. Oh, my saves are much bigger than yours, buddy. My saves are much bigger than yours. Yeah, the shield is definitely a random shield. It's not a... When you're on red heart damage. So here's Isaac, sucking as usual. Got a shield on, so might as well get right in his face. Let Super Meat Gale do some damage. Hello, Isaac. What you gonna do? Absolutely nothing, because you suck. This is one of those rare runs that we haven't had where we just feel super powerful. It's not. We've not been getting a something of crap, we've just been getting lots of powerful power-up items. And again, I'm going to credit that to being the D6, having the D6 on us. One of my favourite items. Every time we've got something that sucks, we've just re-rolled it into something better. Sometimes multiple times. We also spent 10 minutes on that first floor as well, I just remembered that. But yeah, the curse of the... Oh, come on! Little Steven is a buddy. D4. Reroll my run completely. Isaac's tier sucks. Lucky foot. Do we reroll everything we've got? Yeah, screw it. We've got a super powerful run. Let's see what we can turn it into. 
We've got the Beelzebub transformation. We've got the Seraphim transformation. We've got Technology Point Five, uh, number one. We've got Tech X and Monstro's Lung. We've got Harlequin Baby. We've got Isaac's Heart, which sucks. Lil Chub, uh, Mystery Bag, Bomb Bag. What else we got? The Wayfair, Minimush, Guillotine, Case of the Tower, as always. Celtic Cross. Oh, got Holy Mantle, The Body, Explosivo, Toxic Shock. This is a pretty good run. Uh, let's reroll those. Dark Bum and the Hourglass. Let's see if we can get another, another roll on this. This is a very... We got... Homing shots? No, we don't have homing shots. There's the vi that's second syringe, not our third syringe, unfortunately. Or do we have like boomerang tees or something? Oh, we don't have red. Do we have fruit cake maybe? Because that uh, we don't have yet uh, red tees anymore. So it might be like random effects in random rooms. This room kind of sucks. Our bombs seem quite powerful though, which is cool. Loads of money and some more bombs. The stain shouldn't really last at all. There we go. I can't believe we re-rolled our super powerful run into what is potentially an even more powerful run. Yeah, just look at what we're firing off here. This is crazy. Look at the size of these things. We're going to do every single room, by the way, because we could get golden chests with stuff in them. And that's what I'm really looking forward to. There's a key. We're going to go up. We're going to re-roll the item that we left. I can't even remember what it was. Oh, it's re-rolled. The D7. It's not giving me dice. Hey, do you reckon there's a secret room here? Maybe if I put it closer. No. You reckon there's a secret room, like, uh, here somewhere? I'm not sure where the door is on that layout. I always suck at finding doors on that kind of layout. Also, we don't have to worry about creep anymore, because we can fly. Also, I think we have the mind. Or the map. Oh, 4 hour energy. Sweet, we'll take that. Let's go over here. Let's go into the beginning room. Let us use 48 RNG. We'll re-roll this. It becomes Daddy Long Legs. I'll take that. It's a very good item. If you haven't seen that before, uh, Daddy Long Legs will randomly stomp out of the sky and just crush enemies. Which is really good. It's just like the... Oh, we've got homing tots. Yeah, we've definitely got some kind of tier randomizer. Probably fruit cake or something. Another item, it's a bucket of lard for tons of HP up, but it does make us slower. Another pretty fly. Tons of poop in this room, shouldn't last. Yeah, wow. We've also got the explosive uh, f giant bomb fly, that's it. Although I think the bombs will hurt us now, won't they? Because we re-rolled out of Paramaniac. I don't think the effect would stay with us. Another key. Let's try and figure out where the secret room is going to be. A couple of cages. Very tanky. Very annoying in the fact that they can quickly go around the entire level. Isaac's Fork. Consume that enemy. Heal when you kill very often. Not very often, but it happens. Oh, we, we know where the secret rooms are. Why am I even trying? Sometimes I'm just an idiot. And by sometimes, I mean all of the time. I'm an idiot. A few horsemen in here. The Honestly, the best thing we could have happen now is if we somehow find Dad's key. If we were to find Dad's key, it would make me so happy. But the chances of it happening are just non-existent. Another HP up? Yeah, another bucket of lard there. Sweet. It's making us even slower. We're so slow right now, but we've got tons of HP. Puberty pill, there's nothing for us. 
Come on, start dropping some items. You know that's what I want. Give me some items. Bomberman? Mr. Mega, I'll take it. Single black heart, doesn't really matter. Uh, so we're working way up to Blue Baby. Maybe I should have gone to She Hole. She Hole? She Hole instead, considering the fact that. Well, we've always, all seen Blue Baby before, haven't we? What's the card? Judgment! Sweet. Give me Dad's key. Give me Dad's key. You know you want to. I don't know what it is, so I'm going to re-roll it. I know he can't give you Dad's key, so I'm going to re-roll it without even looking at it and get... Blank card. I don't think... I really don't think that's going to help us at all. Will Golden Skeleton Key unlock the Daughter Mega Sitting? I don't think it can, but... I'll give it a try. That'd be just a great ending to this video. Look at our HP. No, we can't, unfortunately. Uh well. You know what, we tried. We've got like a 40-odd minute run going on. We were, what, 15 seconds too late to the boss rush. Uh, to the hush fight, which is insane that we even managed to make it there in that time. Considering we spent 10 minutes on the first floor. That is just boggles my mind that we spent 10 minutes on the first floor. Hey, you know what? We have a battery. Sorry, right. Okay, I have to try. I have to try. Because just think, if we were so lucky just to get the dad's key, just to pull it out, the clutch moment, and get what we need, it would be miracle level actions and absolutely worth the bit of time we spent. You notice we went really fast for a second there? When we were in that room. We're going really fast again here. Hmm. And there, look at how fast we go sometimes. I'm not sure what that is, but... Oh well. Right, let's re-roll this. And we get... Kidney Bean. What a way to end it. On a fart. Oh well. I'm sorry, Blue Baby, but... Yeah, it looks like you might even die without even hitting us, so... There's that. And that is going to do it for today's run. I'm so sorry, guys. You saw me try. You saw me rush. It was that case that I lost that screwed me up so badly. Without it, we would have absolutely decimated that. Been on to Hush. Wrecked him. Wrecked Shop. I would have been so happy. Uh, right, so leave a comment down below. Which character would you like to see me play as in tomorrow's run and on which mode hard mode greed mode and do you want to see hush or mega satan leave a comment down below i've sent through the characters so you've had a chance to look on the notepad on the top left you'll see what is left to do so it goes at the bottom two corners i'm missing a hush and mega satan uh, that's boss rush and mom's heart i think oh it lives sorry Needs to be done in hard mode with Judas. Uh, Eve needs that, that, blah, blah. Lazarus needs a bunch of stuff. Boss Rush. The cathedral and Mum's Heart. Is that Mum's Heart? I don't know. Eden needs Boss Rush. Lost needs Boss Rush and Hush. Not Boss Rush. You know what I mean, Eden and Hush. No. Mega Satan Hush. Wow, I'm losing my brain. I'm losing my brain. Oh, we could do a challenge. I've done all of these already, but I have some new ones, and here's what they are. You don't really know what they are until you play them, so you have to guess from what these are. There's ten more to do. These are generally very, very difficult. So if I do die on them, I can you know, play them over and over. Anyway, leave a comment down below. For now, though, goodbye.